Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Dragon Veil. So, Dragon Veil released a brand new dragon today, on Monday. Um, right before Valentine's Day, or no, a couple of days before Valentine's Day. So this dragon is limited edition. It, it's actually the second Valentine's Day dragon. It's called the Rose Dragon. Uh, so I'm going to do a little recap of last year's Valentine's Day, because I know some of you players are new, and I know you're from the Android version. So last year's Valentine's Day, which is 2012, what happened was they released the very first three element dragon. The three element dragon was called the Love Dragon. If you saw the uh, Love Dragon in the store, that means that um, they re-released it. So that dragon isn't exactly new unless you play after Valentine's Day last year. So this Love Dragon was last year's Dragon Veil's Valentine's Day dragon. And this year we have the Rose Dragon. So this dragon is pretty uh, cool because it's like a flower rose type combined with a dragon. Anyways, uh, you're probably wondering how to breed one of these dragons. Uh, I have tested this. I got the dragon, I think, within six tries. It's not that hard. It's not that easy. One of the main things you have to be cautious about, or something you should know about, is that you have a chance of getting the seasonal dragon, which is 48 hours. And then you have another chance of getting the smoke dragon, which is 14 hours, which is the exact same time for this rose dragon. So don't get too excited until you see the egg, which is like a rose shaped kind of egg. But anyways, let's talk more about the dragon and then we'll go into breeding. The dragon is a three element dragon. It's the element of plant, fire and air. I use the air dragon and the flower dragon to get this dragon. The breeding time is 14 hours, but you have to wait until the egg because the smoke dragon has 14 hours too. Um, that's it. Uh, you can place it into any fire, air, or plant habitat. Uh, good luck breeding and do keep in mind it doesn't really matter which side you're selecting to breed for the dragon, what level your dragons are, and it's ultimately up to luck. So good luck breeding and see you next time.